Sal went to something called a breathwork journey. Okay. It's an event. It was hosted by a dude named Vitali Martino. He claims that most illnesses are caused by unprocessed energy, which is right up, you know, Sal's alley. He yeah. got, he was really excited about this. He went to this thing where um, he was going to release unprocessed energy through intense breathing techniques. And the, the, all the people who go scream and cry and sometimes even vomit. Did you throw up, Sal? No, I did not. I did not throw up. I did hear a lot of people throwing up. It is, it's a, it's <laughs> definitely like, whoa. You know, like you're trying to concentrate on breathing and then you're looking for your spirit guides and all of a sudden you have something just vomiting behind you. It's not so great. In if, that the only, if, if the only way for me to be spiritually connected is through vomiting repeatedly, I don't want it. I don't want to be spiritually connected. I don't. Did the place smell like vomit, Wolfie? Yeah, I mean, mid mid session, the smell in there got pretty intense. Because I, everyone was yeah. vomiting, sweating. Like it, you, I you, remember you, at one point, Howard, I was breathing and trying to concentrate, and I just got this whiff of like hot dogs from somebody vomiting it was just it wasn't great <laughs> that, wow. wow how do you spell whiffed whiffed oh, whiff. i got a whiff <laughs> f-u-c-k-y-o-u robin that's how you spell it wolfie said he saw tears streaming down people's faces and one woman had to be ushered out of the room because she was vomiting so intensely right wolfie oh. yeah they pulled her out of there so quickly. Her hand went up and and like it was like a SWAT team swarmed on her to pull her out. She really? she had a complete and you never saw her again. She just disappeared. And, I don't and know let's what let's be clear. This means it's going well, right? I mean, things are yes, going yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I would have stopped the seminar right now. <laughs> yeah, this would not be a sign that if it was working. <laughs> Robin, I think we better give people their money back. <laughs> We're making them sick. <laughs> you know, Sal is so impressionable. He gets looped into the hysterics and starts screaming too because he's Sal. And, you know, he doesn't yeah. want to miss out. He, Sal wants to be special also. So here's He's Sal. He's got to be a super performer yeah. as well. Right. Sal's going to show them how to really get in touch. Uh, there he goes. Uh, Idiot. guy seriously wolfie it's it was just weird right like seeing little sal now laying on the floor blindfolded screaming right i mean it's just weird and you work with yeah, this I guy mean, he was just opening up so much i i i couldn't believe everything that was pouring out of him it was it was <laughs> oh, really? anyway the experience gave sal an overwhelming sense of gratitude for his loved ones especially his mom he started carrying on Mom, thank you so much for being, being the most wonderful, beautiful, loving person in my world. I'm so grateful for you, Mom, for everything you had to go through. And all what a weirdo. What is that voice? Are you are you crying? Is that what's going on? Like, it's like weird, that voice. Wow. Oh, yeah, tear, tears are streaming down my face, yeah. Well, I, I was You're totally lying down? And lying down, yeah. And my face was completely wet. He was wearing a sleeping mask, and I could see tears coming out the side of the mask. I love you. If I, if you, if I was in the room with you, I'd hug uh, you right now, man. Oh, I love you too, Howard. Uh, really? Yeah, you need a big hug, pal. I would stay away from him under every circumstance. When I, well, when I come over, Howard, for dinner, we can hug. <laughs>